YouTube. What's going on? Woody P coming back with another one. Let's get it. You know I got to keep the fire coming. Today I have a great one. Today I have a great one. I'm more so talking to my man today. Talking to my man today. Because we have to stand our ground no matter where we go at all times. And I love making these videos because I love talking about power and leverage. Because as men... We always have to keep our leverage and we have to, you know, move with power. But today we're going to talk about bully the bully. Yes, bully the bully. I don't care where you go. Wherever your setting is, there's always going to be an enforcer. Somebody that think they run shit. You can't escape this. I don't care where you go, wherever you work. You can play on a team or sports team. If you've ever been incarcerated, there's always someone that everybody kind of shy away from or they feel like, you know, he's that guy. So they don't quite challenge him or they always back down when he speaks up. So that's why I say I'm more so talking to my men. But as men, we must bully the bully. Yes, bully the bully. And some of you probably thinking, shit. What if that motherfucker can overpower you? What if they just big as fucking? You can't do shit with them. How you gonna bully the bully? I know you thinking like that. Like, how the fuck can you bully the bully? Like Red on Friday. He couldn't beat up Debo. How the fuck he gonna bully the bully? I'm gonna tell you how you bully the bully. I'm gonna tell you how. This is how you disarm a bully. It's not about bullying the bully. See, that was the title of the video. But you indirectly bully the bully. When you challenge him head on, yes, yes. When you challenge him head on, it fuck him up because they're not used to getting challenged, first of all. And second of all, it make them think, shit, what the fuck are they capable of? Because I ain't never been challenged. Most people, you know, go the other way when they see me coming or when I say something, they shut the fuck up. So you must challenge them. You look them dead in the eye. So let's just say, I'm going to take it, for example, we playing sports. The best player on the team, you come to a new team. This motherfucking killer, killing everybody. You know what you do first day? You say, hey, man, let's play one-on-one. -on -one. Your ass ain't shit. A bum ass. Let's play one-on-one. -on -one. You challenge him. Everybody else scared to lose. You challenge him. Because it's not even about bullying the bully. You know what it's about? It's about getting the respect so you don't get bullied anymore. Yes, win, lose, or draw, you challenge that motherfucker right away. I don't care where you are. Like I said, it could be different settings. You could be incarcerated in jail. This could be like sports. You know, somebody that you work with that just seemed like they're so overpowering. You challenge them right away. That's how you bully the bully. You know why? Because a bully have respect for motherfuckers that just challenge them and step up to them because they're not used to it. So they'll indirectly have respect for you and stop fucking with you when you bully the bully right away and you step to him and this is the thing too you can't wait you can't wait you can't wait to try to size him up and shit gotta go right at him gotta go right up because motherfuckers will pick up on that on some oh uh, he's seen a little open or he thought he saw some weakness no fuck all of that just go right at him who cares about the results only thing that matters is you challenge that motherfucker and if you lose, you keep challenging them. That's how you bully the bully. Because it's not always about winning. Sometimes you can motherfucking, you be better than the, the motherfucking bully or whatever it is. You could beat them up or beat them at that sport, whatever the case may be. But it's not even about winning all the time. It's about gaining that respect right off the bat. Like, motherfucker, you ain't going to mix me in with the rest of these other motherfuckers. Hell no. I'm coming right at you. And if I lose, I'm going to keep coming at you. And you're going to get so tired that I'm going to fucking end up winning. Because you're going to get tired of fucking playing against me or fighting me, whatever the case may be. But you're going to get that respect. And that's how you bully the bully, just by challenging their ass right away. Like where I, like I say, wherever you go, you have an enforcer, you have somebody that think they run shit, have somebody that think they better than everybody. These are the bullies. You look them right in the eye and you go at them right away. You want the motherfuckers to think you crazy. This is how you bully the bully. Yeah, be like, oh, you said to me? They don't think you crazy. Till you show them, oh, I'm more than crazy. I might even be able to beat your ass. Or if, if I can't, I'm going to keep coming. So you're going to think I'm crazy. And you ain't going to have more, more drive and more stamina than me because I keep coming at your ass. So that's how you bully the bully. It's not even about winning. 
It's not. It's about gaining your respect and coming right at them. Because bullies aren't used to that. They're not. They're used to people backing down, shutting the fuck up, going out of the way. You know, that's what they're used to. That's what they're used to. So that's how you bully the bully. Real talk, one of my life videos, I love it. You know, leverage, power, all of that shit. You know, I'll be on all that shit because that's, man, that's how we got to move. That's how we got to move. Bully the bully. Let me know what y'all think. Drop something down in the comments. Keep the fire coming. Keep it rolling. That's what I do. Coming right at that motherfucker. Fuck him. Fuck him. That's how you bully the bully. But let me know what y'all think. Drop something down in the comments. Keep the fire coming. That's what you help us. Share the video. You know, entertain. Hit that cash up. Keep it rolling. That's what I do. Outside with it, baby. Let's knock another one out. Pop, pop, pop. Let's get it.